Hello everyone, Ali Reza from Nobarom Support here and I'm finally back on track after being inactive for literally 3 months I guess. As you may have noticed from the video title, I'm going to show you how to hide the root from your banking applications and games. Well, basically this tutorial is universal for all phone models with Android 7 and up, so feel free to share this video with your friends. To add more, I'm going to focus more on official Magisk application with ZGISC function. So now, let's get things started. Firstly, you will need to check whether your safety net is passed or not. To clarify more, safety net API consists of several application programming interfaces offered by Google Play services to support security sensitive apps. To do so, you will have several ways. The easiest one is going into the uh, Google Play Store, uh, opening settings, going to about and see whether the device is certified or not certified. In case it says the device is not certified, it means that your uh, safety net has failed. Another way is just uh, searching Yasnes, um, which is another safety net checker tool which you can use. Anyways, uh, if your safety net is failed, uh, you will need to go into Magisk application, open settings, and make sure that Zigis function and enforce denial list is already enabled. If it's not, you will have to enable, enable these uh, two options manually, and then do a reboot. After that, you will need to go into the deny list and here you have to uh, check a uh, show system applications and hide uh, play store and play services as shown in here and then do a reboot after that you will need to um, clear data and cache of play store and play services in case your safety net still failed, you will need to go into Magisk application, go into module section and install universal safety net uh, fix as I have in here. And then do a reboot and your safety net will probably pass now. After passing your safety net, actually there are further steps you need to take to hide root from your applications. For that matter, you need to head into Magic Settings, go into Configure Denial List, and here you will have to hide a root from your banking applications and games just as I did for Play Store and Play Services. After doing so, you will need um, to hide Magic application itself and choose a name for it, for example, Magic. Well, that's something that came to my mind right now and wait for it for a few seconds. Hmm. Why is it taking so long? I hate it. And done. The next step is uh, going to into module section and install Xiaomiko plugin which helps hiding root a bit better. I will include the link down below in the description as well. After flashing um, Xiaomiko plugin in Magisk application, you will just need to do a reboot and done. Okay. If uh, the root is still being detected by your banking application or game, whatever, whatever um, you will need to download Icebox app, Icebox application from the Play Store, which I will uh, include the link down below in the description. And yeah, select root and give it root access. Then uh, you will search for, I don't know, your uh, Magisk application which uh, you just 
hidden like now and then just swipe so it will kill that application and now you can try whether to see whether your banking application or game is still detecting the root After freezing your magisk application using icebox in case you wanted to have it back you just open icebox icebox application and tap on your magisk app now it's not frozen anymore okay anyways in case your uh, banking app is still detecting root you will need to install iceland application which again i will include the link down below in the description now you will have to agree all stuff and create a work profile okay now that it's created you can just scroll down and hmm, for example um, add this to Iceland you will have to grant root access and now it's added there now you have the access to your banking application in the work profile you can just open and hopefully root will not be detected by your banking application or game right now if root is still being detected the root detection error might be related to the rom or kernel being permissive well, a permissive is less secure than some banking applications or games limit phones with permissive kernels uh, from accessing them. Uh, to figure if your uh, to figure out if your ROM or kernel is permissive, you will need to install Termux application. Link down below in the description. Type su space grant to root access and then type get enforce and then enter it will tell you whether your rom is enforcing or permissive i hope you guys enjoyed this video i will soon post the second episode for helping more uh hiding the root so see you in the next episode and peace out